Well, the New York Giants made an early trip to Detroit this week for a pair of joint practices with the Lions. And sports director Brad Galley was in, Al in Allen Park, where players from both teams were excited to finally go up against somebody else. Six buses filled with New York Giants rolled through the gates here in Allen Park to begin the first of two joint practices between the Giants and the Lions. We see a lot of energy from Dan Campbell on this field each and every day. But an hour before the first horn blew, I guess you'd expect him to say seeing another team would amp him up. But the energy level he brought was cranked to an 11. If you have a competitive nature about you, this is as good as it gets. Um, so that's, that's just me. I'm, I mean, yeah, I'm pretty fired up right now. The players, I think, have a lot of respect for him. Uh, he's a high energy. Uh, just a really good coach, a good guy that have a lot of respect for. Dan does a good job emphasizing the importance of it, just, you know, top to bottom. They put a, a pretty big emphasis on these practices of, as far as evaluation and earning jobs. Observations between the Giants and Lions during 11-on-11 11 11 drills. The guys you'd expect to stand out did. Amon Ross St. Brown, reliable as ever. David Montgomery made a nice one-handed catch. And on defense, the D-line, Aiden Hutchinson, blew up New York's O-line a few times. A young player who really turned heads, Jameer Gibbs, who continues to impress throughout camp. To get out and make plays in space like you did today, this is what you've been talking about doing. What did it feel like, Jameer, to do it against another team? Yeah, it felt good. Um, going against another team, you know, we've been going against our guys for the past month now and OTA, so it just felt good getting good work against another team. Yeah, he's pretty good. He's pretty good in space. He's really special, and um, that's always our goal is to get those guys who are special in space, and he's one of them. Teddy Bridgewater. We'll be here next week. Dan Campbell acknowledged the signing but said they expect him at practice starting next week. The consistent presence throughout this camp has been national media. NBC, Fox, ESPN, NFL Network among the national outlets that were here just for the first of two joint practices. Dan Campbell said he likes that. Having another team here, having the national media attention, he said it brings on pressure, a good pressure that you want as a football team, and pressure he said his guys need to get used to all season. In Allen Park, Greg Alley, 7 Action Sports. Hopefully that pressure stays. All right, let's